way. What do you mean? We were supposed to go to Boing Boing Lagoon and sock slide, but you've been spending so much time with your new best friend, Fruki. But you're my best friend. I am? Of course. Fruki's my friend, too. But just because I spend time with other friends doesn't mean I love you any less. It doesn't? No. You're my best friend in the whole world and always will be. Paw promise? Paw promise. Through switcheroo. Ugh. Phew. Bartleby, could you pass me an empty flower pot, please? <laughs> oh. <laughs> You're not Bartleby. Good work, little helpers. I just wonder where my big helper Bartleby went. Uh, fishy poof crackers. Mm. Ah, it's raining! It's raining, it's pouring, and Bartleby is snoring. <laughs> Are you forgetting what day it is today? Is it sleep on the grass day? Nope. Brush my fur day? Nope. Eat a big lunch day? No, silly. We're going to help Griselda with her gardening today. Whoa, now. Stop right there. Where you think you're going with True's flowers? It's okay, Bee. I'm giving them to Griselda so she can add them to her garden. Aw, that's so nice. Okay, enough chatter. Let's get these flowers onto the wagon. Whoa. What was that? Some kind of crystal. <sniffs> smells pepperminty. What kind of crystal smells pepperminty? Hmm, we might be able to tell if we clean it up a little. <gasps> Something's happening! I don't know what just happened. I think this crystal just made your juice ball switch places with that shovel. Wow! What do you know? An actual working for real switch em a jig. Switch em a ball. Yeah, switch em a thing. Switcheroo. Switcheroo. <laughs> that's good, yeah. Yeah, that's what I said. <laughs> Have you ever seen anything so amazing? Just think of all the things we can switch. She has my ball! She has my ball! <laughs> yeah, we're friends again! Wow! <laughs> just happened? I don't know. Ah! You're me. And you're an extremely handsome kitty cat. The switcheroo switched our bodies. I can't be a cat. What about me? How am I supposed to be a human? Or a girl? I don't know how to be either. We <laughs> have to switch back. Uh, how do you hold anything with these paws? Oh, what are all these fingers for? All they do is wiggle around. When are you going to get here to help me with my garden? The Grismas are ruining everything. Help me, True. She thinks you're me. Say something. Like what? Wait, who said that? Um... Hold on, just let me get... We're on our way. See you soon. <laughs> Way? True, we can't go to Griselda's like this. We have to. We promised we'd help. Grab that crystal and we'll try and figure it out there. Okay, but the second we get there, I want to be a cat again. Oh, I don't know how you people live without fur. I'm freezing. Hmm. Put the bench where the bush is and the bush where the bench is. No, no, that's not right either. Put them back where they were. Okay, let's try switching back before we talk to Griselda. Whoa! Phew. It's hard to get a grip on anything with these paws. Who is that back there? Oh no, here she comes. Let her do all the talking. <laughs> yeah, for a change. Uh, Hello. Hi, Griselda. True, Bartleby, you two sound weird. <laughs> anyway, da 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 da! Everything that's here should be there, and everything that's there should be here. And Trey, what are you doing? Uh, hands still dirty from uh, gardening. Okay. Mm, what's this? 
Surprise! Oh, that's so sweet of you, True. <gasps> A crystal? <laughs> it smells like peppermint. It'll be the perfect centerpiece for my garden. True, we need the switcheroo back. Why didn't you tell her it wasn't a gift? I couldn't say anything without showing her that we switched. Grismos, put this <clears throat> on the top of the bird bath right away. It's my new centerpiece, so guard it for <clears throat> all you're worth. Whew. All this gardening is exhausting. Time for a beauty nap. <clears throat> oh, and I want that crystal to be sparkling so I can see my face in it. So be sure to shine it every couple seconds. Thank you. Yeah, Polish it. Every few seconds. Christmas. No, for you. Switch stuff. Yay! Christmas. I really need that crystal back. No. -uh. But everything's getting switched. No. -uh. Mm. Uh oh. Huh? Ooh. Huh? We have to stop all the switching. Never fear. This ninja cat, um, girl, we'll get it back. Uh, Bartleby? I don't know what to do next with your body. I'm the cat. I can leap. Ninja cat, go! Duster, dirty trick. <laughs> no claws, no claws! <laughs> oh, I'm used to landing on my paws. <laughs> Look! The beams are going everywhere, True. Even Rainbow City. Yeah, mustard. <laughs> Please, and bouncy wishes, you can move over here. Hi, see. Greetings, True and Bartleby. I'm just switching some of the wishes spots in the wishing tree. Ah, oh, more switching. Can't things just stay the same anymore? True? There's something wrong with your voice. You sound like Bartleby. <laughs> no, no. My voice sounds the same as always, Z. <laughs> no, Bartleby. My eyes must be seeing things. My ears must be hearing things. Oh, I must be dreaming. Wishes, help me wake up, please. I can't be sleeping on the job. Oh! <gasps> Thanks, Bouncing Wish. It's okay. You're not dreaming. B and I switched bodies. Yeah, True dug up this crystal thing we call the switcheroo. And it zapped us. And now I'm a human, and she's a cat. <sighs> I miss having fur. Great gravity. What a problem this is. Come, let's sit and have a think about this. <sighs> How can the wishes help you, True? Well, first we need to get the switcheroo back from the Grismos. Griselda thinks True gave it to her as a gift, but she did not. Oh, uh, that's, that's awkward. Really awkward. But maybe a wish can help us give Griselda something else that she'll like even more. And once you get the crystal, you can switch yourselves back and everything will be normal, right? Uh, not exactly. 
We saw the switcheroo beams blasting towards Rainbow City. <laughs> what? Uh, huh, landed on my feet. <laughs> <laughs> it is time to get your three wishes. Wait, True's the one who asked for the wishes, but right now I'm True. The wishing tree always knows the real True. But she will need her wish pack. All right. Huh, perfect fit. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Some great wishes, Bartleby. Uh, I mean, true. Let's check the Wishopedia. Your first wish is Snorful. This smelling wish has a very strong nose for sniffing things out. If it's strong enough to move things too, it could help us push all the switched out stuff back again. <laughs> Strong sneezer, too, I bet. Your second wish is Zillion, one of my favorites. It can make exact copies of things, whether you just need one copy or a hundred copies. What could I make a copy of that'll help me? <gasps> the switcheroo! I could give a copy of it to Griselda so I can get the real one back. And your third wish is... Ah, yes. Look-see. The seeing wish. It can help you spot things that our eyes can't see. Hmm. I don't know why we'd need a seeing wish. <laughs> but I'm sure I'll find some way to use it. You always do, True. Thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wonderful wishes with me. You're the best, Z. Good luck, True Bartleby. Uh, you too, Bartleby, True. <laughs> oh, my! Flowerous Magnificus. <laughs> Hello, Bee. <laughs> a, a leaping lemon yellow. Now I'm a bee. <laughs> well, I'd better practice my buzzing. <laughs> bzz, 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 bzz. Break. B, we need the switcheroo first. Ice cream later. Oh, right. It's time to get it back and put a stop to all the switching. Zip zap zoo, I choose you. <laughs> Wake up, Wish come true. Ready to go? Mm -hmm. Hi, Grismos. I really need that crystal back. No. I'm not going to take it. I'm just going to make a copy. I don't care. Perfect. And we'd like one copy of the switcheroo, please. But don't copy its powers. Uh, a rested princess is a happy princess. Okay, everyone. Let's see how things are looking in my... <gasps> my Huh? 
Wow, that's weird. Did everyone just get taller? Ah! I'm a dog. Why am I a dog? I'm really sorry, Griselda. Uh, why are you talking like true? You and your Grismos weren't supposed to have my crystal. It's a switcheroo and it switches things. And people. And cats. It switched our bodies. That's so weird. Ah, that's me. I switch bodies with my fruity kings. What's that? It, it, it's chasing me! Yeah. Whoa. The switcheroo! Right behind you, True! Got it! I'm getting paw prints all over it! Uh-oh. Oh no! How are we gonna find the real switcheroo now? Don't feel bad, Zillion. It's not your fault you got startled. You're a good helper. I can't believe I'm a dog. A really adorable dog, but a dog! Funky <laughs> no! Boys and Grace, be a princess! Come on, B. We gotta find the real switcheroo. I'm with you, Troob. <laughs> This isn't my stop. Okay, things are looking really switched up around here. <laughs> Where did all these trees come from? <laughs> oh, yeah. Bottle look! I found it! Uh, true? It's like a giant game of crystal hide and seek. How are we gonna know which one's the real switcheroo with all the copies? Well. First, we'll have to gather up every last crystal there is. Okay, but how can we find all the crystals if we can't even see where they all are? We don't need to see them. We just have to smell them. Oh, yeah. They smell pepperminty. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you. With a snorkel. Wish comes true. Snorful, I need you to find all the crystals wherever they are. They smell like peppermint. Can you sniff them out for us? Good with these finger thingies. I guess that's all of them. Thanks, Snorkel. Now we gotta figure out which is the real switcheroo. Luckily, I have a system. Grab them. Nope. 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 Can I help? No, I got it. No. Nope. I'm cramp. I'm cramp. This is gonna take forever. There it is again. Nope. None of those crystals was the switcheroo. Maybe it's one of these. There has to be a way to find out which crystal's the real switcheroo without having to polish them all. Let's think about this. Our last wish is look-see. It can see things our regular eyes can't. Right, what's on the switcheroo that we can't see? My paw print! I left paw prints on it when I tried to grab it! That's what Luxie can search for to find the real switcheroo! That's a super incredible idea! <laughs> Let's do this! Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Luxie! <laughs> Wish come oh. true! Hi, Luxie. Huh? We're looking for one special crystal that has a kitty paw print on it. Are you ready to look? Well, where is it? <gasps> kitty paw print! Ninja kitty tree, go! <laughs> yeah! Nice tail 
control. You know what they say, B. Practice makes perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Luxie. You've been a huge help. <laughs> Great job, True. Now, um, switch us back, quick. Okay, Bartleby. <laughs> Whiskers. No whiskers. Tail. No tail. Kitty sense of self-importance. Uh, no tail. I'm back! <laughs> I'm so happy, me! But we've got a lot more stuff to switcheroo. Come on! Can't we celebrate for a second? Okay. One second dance oh! party. Okay, let's go. Let's switcheroo a thing or two. Since wasting all that practice. Thanks, Cumulo. Nice switcheroo, True. <gasps> Tail wagging isn't fun anymore. crystal looks so gorgeous in my garden. I didn't realize it wasn't for me. Great news, Griselda Fruki. You can have all the crystal copies. Just don't ask me to count how many there are. I can't count that high. Yay! Ah! 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 Chase them back, you! Quick, chase them back! Oh, Dr. Fruki! Ah! I kissed a cat! Wait, tail gone, fingers back, ability to curtsy. Perfect. <laughs> so, uh, what are you gonna do with that switcheroo, Drew? Well, I know the perfect spot where it won't cause any more trouble. There. Safe and sound, back in the ground. <laughs> <laughs> Rainbow Rescue! Ending. Could you imagine a full-time rainbow carnival? <laughs> I think it means the rainbow is never-ending, Bartleby. Not the day. Hmm. Where do we start, B? Easy. Breakfast! Then... <laughs> a visit to Dilly Dally's Diorama of Dazzling Delight? Rainbow King! Happy never-ending Rainbow Day, Your Majesty! And to you too, True and Bartleby. So, what's this Dilly with the Dazzly doodads? <laughs> Dilly Dally's Diorama of Dazzling Delight! It's full of the most wonderful treasures from all across the kingdom, like this zookalele. My good friend Dilly Dally gave it to me. You know Dilly Dally, the great explorer? Indeed I do. She is one of my dearest friends, and we both love music, so she always brings me back a musical souvenir from her travels. Can we meet her? Oh, goodness, no. Dilly Dally went on an adventure to find a magical instrument at the end of the never-ending rainbow last year. She's been gone a whole year? No wonder they call her Dilly Dally. Come to think of it, that is an awfully long time, even for Dilly Dally. 
I fear she may be missing. Missing? We have to go find her. Jumping, Juniper. It's far too dangerous, True. Anyone who crosses the never-ending rainbow must be prepared to face anything and come back before sunset. If anyone can find Dilly Dally and bring her back, it's me and Bartleby. Very well. But remember, at sunset, the never-ending rainbow will vanish for another year. We'll move Kitty Nutty fast. Right, True? First things first, we need some wish help. Oh, Cumulo! Thanks, Cumulo. We'll get you back to the carnival in time for the next ride. Do the wishing tree, please. Okay, wishes from the top. <gasps> Musical wishes. True, Bartley. You like jazz? Listen to this. We love to, Z, but we're in a real hurry. Yeah, we're going over the never-ending rainbow. To find Dilly Dally. The great explorer. As I remember, she never came back from her last expedition. Right, so we're heading over the rainbow to find her. That means you'll have to come back by the end of the day. What if you get stuck on the other side, too? We do have to hurry, Z, but we'll be just fine, as long as we have the right wish help. Absolutely. Let's sit and have a think. <sighs> okay, True, how can the wishing tree help you? Well, maybe Dilly Dally didn't come back because she's trapped or needs some kind of help. We have to be prepared for anything. Right, we don't know what you might find over the rainbow. We might not know, but the wishing tree always shares the right wishes. Then it's up to me to figure out how to use them. You always do, True. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It is time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. <laughs> Ensemble of wishes. Now let's see what the Wishipedia says about their powers. This is Booster. Booster. This one will really blow you away. Booster can take a big breath and blow out a super powerful jet of air. I can't wait to see you in action, Booster. Who do we have next? Ah, uh, yes, this is Wampit. Wampit. As you know, Wampit is a stomping wish that just loves to stomp and smash the ground. Nice to see you again, Wampit. I don't know when we'll need your help, but I'm sure we'll have a smashing good time. Wampit! And finally, we have Coral Coral. <laughs> got it, got it, got it. A super rare wish. Coral Coral has grippy powers. It can help you walk on really slippery surfaces. Amazing! I'm glad to have you with us, Coral Coral. Are you three ready for an adventure on the never-ending rainbow? <laughs> Zoo zip zap wishes in my pack. <laughs> Thanks, Z. We'll be back soon. I'm counting on it. Thanks, Cumulo. You should get back to the carnival. We can walk from here. Yep, it'll be nice to stretch our legs a bit. Besides, how long did it take to cross the never-ending rainbow? Whoa! Sky 
Pops. We must be really high up. <laughs> when are we gonna get to the end of this never-ending rainbow? I can't believe Dilly Dally came all this way by herself. I wonder what she was hoping to find. I'm hoping to find the world's biggest Zazuni juice. Mmm, super frosty with lots of ice cubes and... A fork! Um, I think a straw might work better for Zazuni juice, True. No, it's a fork in the rainbow. Look! Huh? Which way should we go? I've got this, True. My tail always knows which way to go. that away. Why did your tail pick that path? Easy. That other path has stairs. <laughs> <laughs> Good call, Tail. Let's go. Well, it's nothing but smooth sailing from here on out. <gasps> right, True? Uh-oh. What do you mean, uh-oh? <gasps> oh, dear. It's like walking a tightrope. We just need to walk slow and steady. This is trickier than I thought. <laughs> Not for a red tabby kitty, Natty. Watch me, okay? Then just do what I do. <laughs> See, True? Easy peasy, rainbow squeezy. Oh, 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 oh. Hang on, Bee. Oh, oh. oh gotcha. Phew. Phew. You okay, Bartleby? I am now. But I don't think I could have held myself up much longer. Whoa, we're high. This could work if we do it together. I'll hold you up. And you hold me up, okay? Yeah, okay, you got it. Ready? Easy. Easy. Okay, come on. Okay. You can do it, True. Just don't look down, because we're up so high. And you don't want to get dizzy. You don't even want to think about falling. Because it'll be like... Oh, I can't look. Done. What? We're here. We made it. We did it. Go teamwork, right? <laughs> Thanks, B. Couldn't have done it without you. And look, we're almost at the top of the rainbow. Yeah, we can handle anything this wacky rainbow can throw at us. <laughs> and I spoke too soon. Come on! We'd better be quick if we're going to beat that storm. Excuse me. Hi. We really need to get to the other side of the rainbow. Could you please let us through? Aw, you're stuck and too full of rain to move? What do we do, Drew? We can't just stroll through a lightning cloud. One wrong move and... <laughs> <laughs> Not if we use some wish power to blow it away. Time for my first wish. Zip, zap, do I choose you? Wake up, Booster. Wish come true. Hi, Booster. See that big storm cloud over there? <laughs> It's stuck on the rainbow, and it needs our help. Let's give it a push with your super strong wind. Okay, Booster. Blow, blow, blow! Ticklish. One more time, Booster. Thanks for not zapping us. <laughs> Great job, Booster. Now back in the pack. Uh -huh. Whoa. Be careful, Bee. It's a little slippery. <laughs> This is fun and all, 
But we don't have any brakes! Prepare for a crash landing! <laughs> wow! We made it, Bee! This is the end of the rainbow! <gasps> Dilly Dally must be somewhere on this island! Hello? Dilly Dally! Are you here? <gasps> Listen, do you hear a tink, tink, tink? You must have cat ears, True. I tink, tink, tink. The tink, tink, tink is coming from over there. Bartleby, <gasps> look. It's her. Dilly Dally. Huh? What? Oh, my. Are you two lost? No. We're here to find you. I'm True, and this is Bartleby. We're friends of the Rainbow King. Bouncing bongos! Any friend of the Rainbow King is a friend of mine. Welcome to the Rainbow's End. I pick a pick to see your friends. Now listen up and look here with big blue eyes and purple ears. I pucker up and give a blow. <laughs> so dearly. I haven't seen him for a whole year. I could never be away from True that long. B but you're in luck. Because he sent us to find you and help get you home. Don't be a silly slide whistle. I'm not lost. I chose to stay here. Huh? huh? I was collecting these magical crystals to make a kazufa flute as a souvenir for Rainbow King. <laughs> but the very last crystal just won't budge. So I'm missing a note. And I am not leaving without it. <laughs> what kind of a friend would I be if I brought home a half-finished souvenir? <laughs> I do not think she's coming with us anytime soon. Mm -mm. He came here to rescue Dilly Dally, and we're not going home without her. Ah, uh, well, we'd better hurry, True. The sun's gonna set soon, and you, me, and Dilly Dally will be stuck here until next never-ending rainbow day. Ooh, wow. Okay, if Dilly Dally won't leave without the last crystal, maybe we can help get it out. Time for my second wish. <laughs> We need your wampin' stompin' power to shake a crystal loose. Wap wap. Okay, everybody. Watch out! <laughs> Ooh, clapping castanets! What was that? Wombat's going to help you get that crystal out. You might want to stay off the ground for a little bit. Hop on! Dilly Dally. And we're going to give it to him today, right? As in, before the sun goes down. <gasps> we might be too late. Without the sun, there will be no rainbow to take us home. <gasps> Come on, let's get moving. <laughs> it's way too steep. Not for my super kitty naughty rainbow grip. <laughs> Remind me to sharpen my claws next time. Is there another way off this island, Dilly Dally? I was going to fix 
figure that part out after I got the crystal. <laughs> so we're stuck here until next never-ending rainbow day? Look on the bright side. We finished the kazoofa flute. What? I didn't even bring any fishy poop crackers. No! Still so many fishy poo flavors to try. Come now, Bartleby. Get a grip on yourself. That's it. I have just the thing to help us get a grip. It's time for my third wish. Your help to climb to the top of that super steep rainbow. Go, go, go! Uh, come on, hop in! Now, we all need to run as fast as we can. It's working! Um, why is the rainbow flickering? The sun is setting! We're running out of time! Faster, everyone! them so much. Wait, could it be? It's too late! The rainbow's gone! Oh, no. ah! We're not gonna make it, I don't think! Here you go! Terrific tambourines! You saved us! Of all the cushy, fluffy things I love, you're the best. Thanks, Cumulo. I knew I could always count on you. You too, Coral Coral. Now back in the pack. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry I was away so long, but I just couldn't come home without a special treasure for you. Fantastic fuchsia! A kazoofa flute! <laughs> <laughs> but Dilly Dally, as wonderful as your souvenirs are, there's no greater treasure than a true friend. Oh, Rainbow King, you're so right. And I have two new friends who cared enough to come look for me. Aww. I'm sorry you missed your never-ending rainbow day. Well, not the whole day. You didn't miss the grand finale. Rocketing red and booming blue. A special sight for me and you. Here it comes. The best part of never-ending rainbow day. Fill the sky with wondrous light. Find a friend and hug them tight. Bounciest place in the kingdom. Bouncy fun, here we come! <gasps> uh, greetings, True and Bartleby. Hi, Your Majesty. Forgive my haste, but I'm in a rush to get to the never-ending chit-chat council. 
The never-ending chit-chat council? You mean the chit-chat never ends? Oh, <laughs> no, 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 no. It's only for the day. It's just called that because it's held in the never-ending forest. Oh, okay. <laughs> How could I think? <laughs> I almost forgot why I asked you here. Would you two mind castle sitting for me today? No, what? Really? You want us to castle sit for you? Of course! I trust you, True. You'll have no trouble at all. Especially taking care of my rare and exquisite, flowerous, magnificus. <laughs> Admire its beauty, but best not to touch it. No problem. Bye for now. Off we go! Bye, Your Majesty. Have fun. <sighs> Bye, Boing Boing Lagoon. Aw, cheer up, Bee. I'm sure we'll have just as much fun here. How? Castle floors aren't bouncy. No, but they are slippery. And you know what you can do on slippery floors in your socks, right? Slide-a-thon! I'll borrow the Rainbow Guard socks. <coughs> <coughs> yeah, no, I won't. Huh? I'll just use my fur! <laughs> slide <-a> thon <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Griselda, what are you doing here? The Rainbow King told me you were castle sitting, True. I would help, but I'm going to the never-ending chit-chat or whatever, too. It's all part of being a princess. So you wouldn't mind if I left my precious Frookykins here with you while I'm gone? Whoa, 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 whoa. Leave Frookie here with us? But we were busy sliding. <laughs> Come on. It's okay. Frookie's sweet. I'm sure we won't have any trouble. Yeah, no trouble at all. Whoa! Great. Here's Ricky's favorite ball. Mwah! Smooches! Ta-ta! Come on, Bee. We can all play together. <laughs> Fetch, Fruki! <laughs> You're really good at this. Uh-oh. Oh, no! No, Fruki! Hmm, my super slide should win True back. Hey, True! <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> you two look thirsty after all that playing. I'm fine. But Fruk's all out of drool. <laughs> I'll get a bowl of water. Be right back. <laughs> Fine. Fetch. Fruki, I got your water. Where's Fruki, B? I don't know. Fetching. So, how about a quick slide before he comes back? Just you and me. You're on. Whoa. <laughs> Fruki? Hmm. I wonder what Fruk's doing in the greenhouse. We better check. Oh, so close. <gasps> no, Fruki, don't. <sighs> Many 
Frookies! This castle is so big! How can I catch all the Frookies if I can't even find them? I have to get some wish help, but I can't leave the five Frookies alone. I'll keep an eye on them while you're gone, True. <laughs> Today, Cumulo, up to the wishing tree, please. <laughs> Hi, Z. True, there, hello. Huh? Talking, am I? Ubu with. Ubu? <laughs> Ubu is a backwards wish. You have to talk backwards to it. Oh, um, Z. Hi. Help wish some need I. <laughs> <laughs> back up you go. Or is it go you up back? Come and sit down, True. <gasps> How can I help? Well, I meant to be castle sitting, but Griselda dropped off Fruki. And then the king's flowerous magnificus turned one Fruki into five. Oh, boy. How can the wishing tree help? I need some wishes to help me round up all the Frookies. Then turn them back into one again before they wreck the Rainbow Castle. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It's time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Interesting wishes, True. I can tell you more about them. Let's check the Wishopedia. Your first wish? Ah, yes, Sizer. It can make you minuscule or gargantuan. Gargantua what? Minuscule means very small, and gargantuan means very big. With this wish, you must snap your fingers to get it to stop. Gotcha. If this wish can make me really big, it'll be easier to catch all the Frookies at once. Your next wish is... Joiner. It can make several objects into one. Just make sure they're all close together, or it won't work. That's good to know. The last wish you have is... Floto. Ooh, how exciting. It can make very big bubbles that you float around in. A big floaty bubble maker? Hmm. I can't think of how that will help me with the Frookies. But you will think of a way, True. You always do. Thanks, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wishes with me. <laughs> Let's go, Wishes. <laughs> I brought some wishes. Where are the Frookies? I left them in the kitchen with some fishy poop crackers, then came out here for a snack. Pretty smart, huh? Frookie <gasps> games, I'm back! Griselda! If she sees five Frookies, she's gonna freak out. Okay, I'll keep her busy while you fix the Frookies. Uh-oh. <laughs> There's one. Frookykins? 
No, the things I do to help True. I am some kind of something. Okay, here it goes. Woof! Fruki! Nailed it! Hurry, <laughs> True. I need all the Frukies together. How can I get them in here? Aha! Fishy Poof Crackers! They love these! Come and get it! Now's my chance! Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, joiner! Wish come true! <laughs> okay, let's join all the Frukies back into one. Okay, joiner, spin around the pot as fast as you can! Cool! Let's see how it worked! Fruki? <laughs> <laughs> you did it, Joiner! Great job! Oh, I'm going to cover my fruity rookie with little kisses! <laughs> Bartleby! Hey, hi. Uh, nice beard, Griselda. <gasps> I kissed a cat. <laughs> So is Fruki. But Fruk's been such a good little doggy. <sighs> but I'm a good kitty. <laughs> I guess she'd rather have a good dog. <laughs> Fruki boom. <laughs> okay, Bartleby. Let's do some more sliding. Bartleby? I could leave and never come back, and True would never even notice. <sighs> But I bet she'd notice if there were five of me! <laughs> so, how does that magic pollen work again? Abracadabra! Ugh. Presto changeo! <sighs> uh, it was worth a try. I'm so happy to have you back, my little... <gasps> Fruity! Oh no, not the greenhouse again! What do you mean, again? <laughs> How much crazy stuff can one plant do? <laughs> True. I've got this. There. No more fruity getting in. No more plant problems. Big hero hug. Bring it in. Come on. True. <sighs> How do I catch a giant dog that's too big to catch? <gasps> I make it smaller. to make Fruki smaller? Z 
Zee said I have to snap my fingers to get him to stop. Oh no! I can't do it! Bartleby, snap your fingers! I don't have any! I've got this. I'm very good at getting attention. Follow Fruki through the keyhole. I know I'm asking you to do some extra work, but can you shrink us down? Ah! Thanks, Sizer. Ah. Come on, B. B. Whoa, Bartleby! Where are you going? Away. What do you mean? We were supposed to go to Boing Boing Lagoon and sock slide, but you've been spending so much time with your new best friend, Fruki. But you're my best friend. I am? Of course. Fruki's my friend, too. But just because I spend time with other friends doesn't mean I love you any less. It doesn't? No. You're my best friend in the whole world and always will be. Pa promise? Pa promise. Best day ever. That's beautiful, but we have a puppy to save over here. Come on, Bartleby. Slide of time! Okay, Sizer, shrink us down, please. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thanks, Griselda. Yes, yes, just hurry up. Wow. It feels weird being small. <gasps> How big would a fishy poof cracker be right now? You can snack on some just as soon as we rescue. Fruki! We're coming, Fruki! Whee! Come on, Bartleby! This'll be fine. Cats always land on their feet. Oh! Are you okay? I made it, I think. I mean, I mean, that's the important thing. No, oh, Bartleby. Fruki. <laughs> Somebody's glad to see us. It's okay, Fruk. No need to be scared. We'll get you out of here. Now, if we can just get big again, we can open the door and leave. What made Fruki big before? It was one of those petals on the king's plant. I'll go get one. I mean, someone else will go get one. It's okay, B. Let's just think this through. We need to touch one of the petals. And to get up there, we'll use my last wish. Float out. Won't we just float away? Yes, but I have an idea. If we run really fast, it'll roll. Then we can steer it over to the plant and touch the petal. That's it. Float out. Let's do this. Let's get ready for liftoff. Whoa! Wow! This bubble floats fast. Run towards the flower. We have to get to its petals. Oh, keep running, keep running. We're almost there, guys. <laughs> Just... <laughs> no! <laughs> Yay! We did it. Thanks, Floto. Mm -hmm. Time to go back in the pack. Perky <laughs> buttons? Fruity snuggles? Fruity whoa! <laughs> oh, I'm happy to see you too, Fruity Kins! Oh. Tro, how was your day of castle sitting? Not too difficult, I hope. Well, we have a lot of fun sock sliding. But we had a few accidents today, Your Highness. Oh, I'll say. Uh, that's all right. Accidents happen to the best of us. Yes. Everything seems to be in tip-top shape despite the accidents. Oof, I'm glad to hear it. Oh, 
I should check on my flowers, Magnificus. It, it didn't bloom yet, did it? Your flower is the one thing we couldn't fix. We're very sorry. Oh, my. Oh, my. Oh, my! Huh? Flabbergasting fuchsia. <laughs> what luck! Luck? Accident or not, its petals fell off early. That means it's going to bloom sooner than I thought. Look! It's happening now! Isn't it spectacular? <sighs> Nothing like the flower is magnificent in bloom. <laughs> Four Rainbow Kings? Don't, Don't worry, easily remedied. Gesundheit! See? Happens all the time. All we had to do was say Gesundheit? Now there was some talk of sock sliding, I believe. I'm in. Come on, Furky. Let's go! Woo! Wait for me! <laughs> right behind you! <laughs> for the party tonight. No, you don't. Cuz, I planned your whole party. Really? Yep, it's my gift to you. I'm gonna make sure you have the most amazing birthday ever. You won't have to do a single thing today, True. Aw, oh, B, you're the best. I know, but we've got some serious birthdaying to do. Let's get going. It's my birthday. Ready for a treat? I made something extra special. Guess what it is? <laughs> it's you! Yeah! I call them Bartle Biscuits. I got the idea from the mirror. <laughs> hmm. Which part should I eat first? My ears, of course. Good choice. Hey, this kind of tastes like Stranilla. <gasps> Are we having Stranilla cake at my party? You'll have to wait and see. With wiggly jiggly jelly and bubble chew icing? Mm-hmm. Yeah. And as your best friend, I of course knew you'd want all those different flavors together. It's definitely not just a basic mellow berry cake. Uh huh, B. You know me so well. Can I borrow your face bubble thingy for a non-birthday emergency? Sure. Here, have another Bartle biscuit. Try eating it as loud as you can. Uh, loud enough? Griselda, answer my face bubble. Griselda, we have a birthday emergency. <gasps> you ran out of glitter balloons? No, we need to change the mellow berry cake into a straw nilly wiggly jiggly jelly bubble chew icing cake. Oh, that's no problem. Baking isn't hard. All you need is a princess's delicate touch. Uh, uh, ah! But you don't have a recipe. Princesses don't need recipes. We're amazing at everything we do. Right, Grismos? Uh, okay, but don't forget the cake is the most important part of our party. Obvi. That's why I'm in charge of it. Okay, Grismos, you heard Bartleby. Mellow Berry's out and Stranella Wiggly Jiggly Jelly Bubble Chew Icing is in. 
Where's my super fast ever rise powder? Let's add more. More is better. Hey, guys, everything good with the decorations? Okay, great. Talk to you soon. All aboard the Mushroom Town Birthday Express. Hey, yeah! Everyone's on their way? You bet. Right on schedule. Great! Hey, Bingo Bango! You know the way, right? You turn left at the never-ending forest? Oh, yeah! Um, okay, I'll take that as a yes. Who's ready for ice cream lunch? Ice cream for lunch? We can do that? Sure, it's your birthday. Let's put the scream in ice cream birthday lunch. Perfect. Ready to bake. Uh, uh. Ugh, what are you girls doing? Step aside. This needs a princess's delicate touch. Baking would be hard if I wasn't so good at it. Okay, Bartleby. I think that's enough. Just one last thing to top it off. A fishy poof cracker. Whoa. Whoa. to my party. Ah, uh, you weren't gonna wear that anyway. Cause we're gonna get you a new outfit! Really? But only after you finish all your ice cream. Challenge accepted. No, 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 no. This simply won't do. We need to make it pop. Because all together, more is better. See? Birthday! 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 Nothing's going to stop this express bus to True's birthday party. Except for this delicious goo. Hey, what's the hold-up? I gotta get to Drew's party. Pardon me, I have a party to attend. Can you please move it along? Yeah, well, what's going on? Okay, this is perfect. Ready to see my new birthday suit? Is it as cute as mine? <laughs> I love it! In that fabulous outfit, you are going to rock this party. What's that? I don't know, but we better go check it out. What's going on? A traffic jam? Juice party bus. Oh, hello, Rainbow City bus. Shouldn't you be on your way to someplace very important? Mayhaps. Well, I should, but as you can see, I'm stuck in this delicious goo. It does smell yummy. It is yummy. And it tastes a lot like bubble chew icing. Griselda! Oh. Well, that's wiggly and jiggly enough for a regular cake eater. But this cake needs to be princess level wiggly jiggly. More is better. Hey, Griselda, do you know anything about some bubble chew icing traffic jam? Bartleby, I'm in the middle of making the most important cake of my career. I need my space. I'll talk to you later. But Toodles! Now, where were we? Ah, yes. Ah! Everything's shaking. Bartleby, look! The trees, they're falling. <gasps> we need to go see what's going on. Oh, cute! 
do. We got to... Um, uh, what, what about the... Come on, Bartleby. Ugh. We'll be right back to help you out. Stay put. I hope all the forest critters are okay. I'm sure the forest critters are fine. You don't really need to do any hero stuff today, do you? I don't know, B, but let's go and check it out anyway. What happened? Is everything okay? These trees are blocking your path? Hmm. Well, maybe the three of us can move it. Ah, true. Can it wait? We still have that ooey gooey traffic jam to clean up. If we don't help, no one will be able to come through the forest. Bingo, bingo! Party decorations! We need to move this tree right now! That's the spirit? It's too heavy! This isn't working. Time for some wish help! To the wishing tree! Birthday, True. I uh, wasn't expecting to see you until your party. The party will have to wait, Z. There was some kind of earthquake. Yeah, we felt it up here too. It knocked over trees in the never ending forest and no one could get around. And there's a sticky situation in Rainbow City. A sticky, gooey situation. And it's causing a huge traffic jam. Oh, that does sound serious. But sit and have a think. Okay, True, how can the wishing tree help you? Well, first we need to get the trees back upright in the never-ending forest. Yeah, and let's not forget, they're super heavy. Then, we have to get the gooey glob off the Rainbow City streets. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It is time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. <laughs> wishing tree. Wait till you see what the Wishipedia says about these. First up is Lifto. Lifto! This wish is incredibly strong. It can lift anything you place on top of it. Just give it a spin. Wow! Lifto, you can help us get all the trees standing again. Lifto! And next we have... Pumpa. Pumpa! This wish can blow air into anything, like a flat tire. Or a balloon bouquet. Pumpa! Or a giant gooey glob like the one causing the traffic jam. Maybe Pumpa can blow it into a bubble and float it away. Pumpa! Oh, you're gonna love this one. Meet Kakaraka, one of the most powerful wishes of all. Kakaraka! Kakaraka is a bursting wish that can help break large things into smaller pieces. Wow! I'm not sure how I can use Kakaraka just yet, but I'm sure it'll be a blast. <laughs> <laughs> Zoo zip zap wishes in my pack. <laughs> Thanks, Z. Bye, Z. Good luck, you two. We're back. Thanks for waiting. Let's see if we can move these trees off the road for you. Time for my first wish. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you. Wake up, Lifto. Wish come true. Hey-ho, Lifto. Hey. See all those fallen trees? Hey. We need you to lift.
lift them back up again. Which will clear the path and allow everyone to get where they need to go. <laughs> oh, I'm just excited about getting people moving again. Go and then taking uh, care of my beautiful skin. Ready to help clean it up? Pumba! Great! I bet we can blow a huge bubble out of that goo. Pumba power, go! Oh, yay! <laughs> Pumba! Thanks, Pumba. That really blew me away. Now back in the back. Thanks, Drew. See you later. You're welcome. Well, I was hoping you wouldn't need to do any of that hero stuff today, but you took care of that pretty easily. I did, didn't I? Hey, Griselda! Ugh. True! I wish you the most happy birthday! Ugh. Aw! Thanks, Griselda! May I please talk to Bartleby about nothing to do with cakes? Sure thing! <laughs> okay, what is it, Griselda? Bartleby! This cake is not doing what I told it to do. Stay! No! Cake. The words bad and cake are not something I want to hear. What's going on? Well, it turns out more is not always better. The Stronilla cake layer is a bit bigger than I expected. Like, oops, it's so big we're going to be eating cake for a week. More like, oops, it's too big for the oven. And the kitchen. And maybe the house. Ah, come quick, I'm not sure I can hold this one. Huge, totally on purpose birthday cake. B, you shouldn't have. I really shouldn't have. Uh, that'll be for me. Bartleby, the strangest thing just happened. I'm suspended in this scrumptious stranilla sponge cake. I've been stuck in a traffic jam before, but never a traffic jelly. This cake is going straight to Fruki's obedience school. I can't even know what to do. Hi, B. Hi, True. Hmm. There might be a small problem with the party. Oh, you mean that giant birthday cake that fell over on Mushroom Town and has all our birthday guests stuck inside the delicious ooey gooey icing? Uh huh. That wasn't part of my plan. True, I hate to ruin your day, but I think I really need your help now. It's okay, B. Helping people is my favorite thing to do. Oh, Cumulo! Hi, Cumulo. We've got a cake problem. To the Mushroom Town. This cake is huge. And it looks delicious, too. Should we just eat our way through? Because I'd be okay with that. Well, as yummy as that sounds, 
It might take too long. It's time for my third wish. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Kakaraka! Wish come true! Hi, Kakaraka! We have a giant cake problem. We need your help. Kakaraka! Ready, Kakaraka? Kakaraka! We're rooting for you, Kakaraka! Kakaraka! Okay, now wait for my signal. On my count. Three, two, one. Kakaraka! To, and besides, you don't even have a cake. Bartleby, I had the most incredible day. Mostly because I got to spend it with you. I love the picnic and the ice cream lunch, and I love my outfit. Everything you did today came from your heart, and that made this the best birthday ever. Huh? What? Anyone's had a birthday party like this before. Kakaraka! Way to go, Kakaraka! Zoo, zip, zap, wishes in my pack. Happy, happy, happy birthday, birthday true. true! Best, Best party, party ever! party is amazing! Thanks, everyone! This is even better than the best birthday party ever, and it's all thanks to Bartleby. Great, Great job, Bartleby! Bartleby. Ah, shucks. Thanks, True. You deserve it. True? Hey, where'd you go? And now for your birthday entertainment. Whoa. May I please present to you our great guest of honor. Whoa. are we going to go to? How many? All of them. The pie-eating contest, the Yeti stomp dance contest, the Rainbow City bus toot salute. They all asked me to be a judge today. Wow! That sounds like a lot of stuff to do. Yeah, but I'd love to do a lot and help a lot. <laughs> and giggly green morning to you, True and Bartleby. Join us in celebrating all that makes Rainbow Kingdom fun and wonderful. Fun to wonder! Oh, I brought a special surprise for this year's festival. A Hinotari egg. The Hinotari mama bird lays only one egg every thousand years. Aw, what a nice thing to share with us for the Funda Wanda Festival. Oh, and speaking of the festival, True, I am a bit concerned about all the royal functions I must attend to while watching the egg. I can watch the egg for you while you do all your fun to wonder kingly duties. Really? Why, thank you, True. <laughs> You're always so helpful. <laughs> oh, how cute. Ah, uh, True, 
Aren't you already busy with a bunch of events today, kind of? I am, but I can do all that and watch the egg. No problem. Thank you, True. Enjoy the Funda Wonder Festival. Yeah, the egg is, well, an egg. But this ice cream cone is amazement. True, check out my multi-flavored Mega Scoop Monster Cone. Five second roll. What? Mm, two. <laughs> That's my first event, the Rainbow City Bus Toot Salute. Mm. On your way, Judge True, have fun. Mm. doesn't seem to like loud noises. I got this. You go honk it up with the buses and I'll tootle around with Eggie here. Thanks, B. I'll be back soon. Ah, uh, cat's work is never done. Who's my Eggie? You're my Eggie. Yeah. Oh, hello, True. Are you ready to judge the toot salute? <laughs> oh, where's the Hinotari egg? Eggie doesn't like loud noises, Your Highness. So Bartleby's watching it until I get back. Ah, good thinking. All right, buses, let's hear those toots. Nice! Oh, lovely! Golden gardenias! It's beautiful! We have a toot salute winner. Congratulations! Oh, my! Eggs are particularly comfortable with kitty cats. It's obvious the calming effect of a nurturing kitty cat. Hey, me! <laughs> How's Eggy doing? Over easy. <laughs> Just a, that's an egg joke. It means Eggy's fine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good. I guess I didn't have to scramble back. <laughs> oh, look at that scramble back. <laughs> good one. Hi! The Yeti Stomp Dance Contest must be starting now. Sitting. Thanks, B. Back soon. Eggy, want a balloon? <laughs> Maybe we'll just pick a couple to tie around you. Oh, this one looks nice. No, no. Oh, look at that. That's incredible. Look at the colors on that one. That's a. Oh, oh, wait a minute. That one. No, no. How about those two? Wait. Mm -mm. Mama. Maybe those ones. There. Yeah. Hold on. Balloons are floaty. What if they carried Eggy away? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what am I worried about? It's not like you're gonna... Boom! Hatch and run away! Oh, no. Now, um, Hatcher, where are you? I've got balloons. Hatcher, oh, that chick could be a million miles away by now. You know what to do, Rocky. Step right up and win a prize. Can you guess if this is a rock or a rock critter? Make the right guess, and the prize is yours. Hmm, rock. Critter. Nope. Rock. Oh. Rock critter? <laughs> awesome! Congratulations! Yay! Um, Miss True, uh, ma'am? The pie-eating contest. I forgot about that one, too. I really <laughs> need to get back to Bisu. Boy, you love corn, huh? <laughs> That's great. Hey! <laughs> no tickling my nose now. <laughs> that was a tickle, I think. Nice red tail feather, by the way. <laughs> Mama? No, 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 no. Stay put, little Hatcher, okay? While we go find True. <laughs> 
Hatcher. Oh, no, 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 Hatcher! Hatcher! Hey, baby! <laughs> What's wrong? Um, funny story. Um... <gasps> the egg? It hatched? Yeah, just a little. Okay, a lot. It hatched a lot! And it ran away! Oh, no! I should have come back sooner. The Rainbow King is counting on me. We have to get Eggie back. I call her Hatcher now. You know, since she hatched and everything. <sighs> you promised to help out on too many things today, B. But I couldn't keep up. I should have never taken on the egg sitting job. And now this happened. I'm sorry. No big deal, True. Everyone knows how much you want to help. And I'm here to help you. Thanks, B. You're the best. Now, let's go find Egg... Uh, I mean, Hatcher. She went that way. Hatcher! What a sweet little chickie. Mama? Oh, she thinks I'm her mama. Did you see that? A kiss from Hatcher? Turns people into chicks. We've, We've got to stop, stop this. this. Follow that chick. Hatcher's speedy. You should see how fast she ate a cob of corn. She likes corn? Quick, be grab one. Oh, Hatcher, over here. I have lots of yummy, yummy corn. <laughs> oh, greetings, Hinotari chick. <laughs> you know, Tari Chick. Oh, my. <laughs> oh. Mm. You okay, little fella? <laughs> True, <gasps> Bartleby. And the Hino Tari Chick has hatched. We know, we know. We're trying to find her. But we must do it soon. Until the Hino Tari Chick gets a kiss from its mother, it will keep kissing citizens. It will? Yes. And then it won't be long until everyone is turned into a chick. <gasps> Not to worry. Fortunately, I know the best way to catch a Hinotari chick. It's as simple as... Rainbow What is going on around here? I came to the Fun to Win a Festival to have fun. If something bad is happening, keep it away from me. <laughs> Hatcher's searching for her mama, and she's kissing everyone in sight until she finds her. Well, we better reunite them fast. One Hinotari chick is cute, but a whole town full? Come on. We need some big time wish help. Oh, Cumulo! <laughs> to the wishing tree, please! To him, Bartleby. Oh, what's going on with the wishes? We're celebrating the Fun to Wonder Festival by playing our own games in the wishing tree. Right now, they're about to do a sack race. I'll be the judge at this event. On your mark, get set, go, wishes! Don't worry. We'll play a lot of games so that you can all get a ribbon. <laughs> now, how can the wishing tree help you, True? We have a problem, Z. The Hinotari chick hatched, and now the chick is kissing everyone and turning them into chicks. Oh, no. Oh, yes. Even worse, it's going to keep happening until we get her back to the top of Mount Tippy Tippy Top to get a, a kiss, kiss from, from her mom. mom. Great gravity. What a dilemma. Let's sit and have a think about this. <sighs> How do you plan to fix this problem? Well, I need a wish to help me bring all the chicks together so I can pick out the real one. Sounds good. Any other ideas? I'll need another wish to help me change them all back again. Good thinking. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It's time to get your three wishes. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me.
like these wishes a lot. Let's see what the Wishopedia says about them. Hmm. Oh, here it is. Your first wish is Tis Way, a musical wish that plays music so enchanting that everyone wants to follow the wish around. That's handy. The chicks can follow Tizway's music so I can get them all together in one place. Your second wish is Tintly. Ooh, how bold. This color wish can change the color of any object anywhere. Hatcher likes corn. Maybe I could color the egg stroller yellow. Then Hatcher will hop back into it. The stroller could look like a big, juicy corn niblet. <laughs> <laughs> and lastly, you have Flecto. Flecto can not only show reflections in its mirror, but it can make himself bigger and smaller as well. I'm not sure how a mirror can help us round up all the chicks, <laughs> but I'll find some way for it to help. You always do. Thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wishes with me. Okay, that's not on the same page, no. I'll herd them all together with some music. Zip, zap, zoo, I shoot you! Wake up, Tisway! Wish come true! Tisway, do you know a song that these chicks might like? Uh-huh! Great, let's hear it. Hey, it's working! But won't they just run around again? Stops? Not if we round him up and put him somewhere. And I know just the place. Let's go! and get a better look, then maybe we can pick out the right chick. Thanks, Tisway. Great job. <laughs> Go Cumulo! Hmm. <sighs> the real one's hard to pick out. They all look the same. Yeah, they all have those big, dewy eyes and cute little tails with that one little red feather. One little red feather? Yeah, just like the one Hatcher tickled my nose with. Um, B, I only see one red feather. <laughs> that must be Hatcher! Yay, B! <laughs> <laughs> Again. We need something to get their attention. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Like a... <gasps> a big cob of corn! What? Zazuni juice balls! Ta-da! One big kitty corn cob! But it's purple. At least it's easy to move in. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Spoke too soon. I mean, just have to get used to it. And my second wish can help us with the color part. Zip-zap-zoo, I choose <laughs> Wake up, Tizzly! <laughs> wish comes true! Hi, Tintly. I need to 
make Barbie's disguise yellow. Just enough to make him corny. Do you think you can help? Uh-huh. <laughs> Done. Now you're super corny. I really am. Hey, wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Tinsley. <laughs> Let's round them up again. Here, chicky chickies. I have a giant cup of corn for you. Why don't they want my delicious corn body, True? Try acting more like corn. Act more like corn? What does she mean by that? Oh, okay, here goes! <laughs> corn, 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 I'm a corn on the cob. Corn, 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 doing such a great... Um... Job! There, that rhymed. It's working! Too well! Run! Keep going, Bee! Back to where we heard of them before! Yeah, I'm running as fast as I can! Oh. Oh. Hurry, Bee! You can do it! I made it! I made it! Uh, I didn't make it! Bartleby! Oh, my poor little kitty chicky! <laughs> Bartleby, I'm the only one left who isn't a baby bird. <laughs> Whoa, Griselda, you changed back? True. I do not know what's going on here. <laughs> but you better. <laughs> the puddle. <laughs> That's it. When the chick saw its reflection in the puddle, it changed back into Griselda. It would be a lot faster to use my mirror wish to change all the chicks back. Zip zap zoo, I choose you! Please, Lefto! Wish come true! Lefto, are you ready to help me change everyone back? Mm-hmm. Great! Let's go! Hi there! Who's this cute little face I see? Huh? Hey, it works! Thanks, True. Why do I have this urge to eat corn on the cob? Hi! Hello. Hey, thanks. Wait! Come back, chickies! <sighs> this would be much easier with a bigger mirror. <gasps> Flecto! I need you to be bigger so every chickie can see itself. <laughs> thanks! Let's roll! <laughs> Look over here, please, Chicky! Purple persimmons! I'm a king again! Here, Chick Chick Chicks! Well, it's about time! Oh, my little spooky whoops! <sighs> I'm my beautiful silky cat self again! True! I'm so glad you're back, Bee! You were the last one! Everybody's back to being themselves again! Sweet! But where's Hatcher? Right here! <laughs> we must get her to her mama on Mount Tippy Tippy Top before she kisses anyone else! There's no time to waste! Oh, Mama Hinotari bird. We brought you a little something from the festival. Wow. Do you think it worked? Only one way to find out. May I? Thank you. You're welcome. It worked. I'm not a chick. <coughs> And me. Thanks! <laughs> <laughs> the Living Sea. <sighs> Would you like a nice cold Zazuni juice, Bartleby? 
It's the best way to cool off on a hot day at the beach. Just don't get brain freeze. <laughs> How can my brain freeze when my head's so nice and warm, True. <laughs> brain freeze is what it feels like when you drink cold drinks too fast. So sip it slowly. Brain freeze! <sighs> Body freeze! Pa freeze! Tail freeze! Tail freeze, you anyone? I got it! Huh? <laughs> Good, fantastic. I'll go see if Rainbow King and his guards want some. It needs a grand entrance where I can welcome my visitors and plenty of windows to see the kingdom from. Oh, and don't forget the balcony. Oh. That's where I address my citizens. Oh, oh. Thirsty, Your Majesty? Ah, oh, yes, thank you, True. My castle builders could use a break. Ice cold Zazuni juice. Oh, oh. Mm. Don't drink it too fast, or else you'll get <laughs> brain freeze. <laughs> Ooh, a royal brain freeze. Oh, very refreshing. <laughs> so, what do you think? Does my sand castle look like my real rainbow castle? <laughs> Whoa! I can hardly tell them apart. Uh, what? Bartleby, did you finish the rest of the juice? <laughs> huh? What, me? No! What? Did I? Wait, let, let me check. No shivers, no chills, no brain freeze. Nope, wasn't me. Oh, hey, hey! A sea blob? Oh, you're so cute. Did you drink all our juice? <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. I bet you just wanted to cool off a bit. Blop, blop. Then let's go for a swim! Blop, blop. <laughs> yeah, this shade sure does the trick. A sea blob that doesn't want to go in the sea? That's not sea blobby at all. Blop, blop. Blop, blop. Blop, blop. Blop, blop. Whoa! Blop. I almost got blubbed big time! This is most unusual. Sea blubs hardly ever leave the water. Hmm. <gasps> the water's not cool at all. It's warm. Really warm. They're just trying to cool off in the shade. Maybe something's wrong with the living sea. Well then, we'd better check on it. Follow me. Come on, Barbie! Huh? Living sea? Oh, yes, we go way back. I knew it when it was just a little puddle. <laughs> oh, wide and wonderful living sea, I ask that you please meet with me. Whoa. Rainbow King, how good to see you. These are my friends, True and Bartleby. They're very eager to meet you. The pleasure is all mine. The living sea doesn't look very lively today. If you don't mind me asking, um, your wetness, are you feeling okay? The heat, it makes me sleepy. Heat makes me sleepy too. The living sea must be part cat. But your water is always cold, even on hot days. That is correct. A family of ice stars keep me nice and cool. Ice stars? Yes, they keep the living sea cool. Just like the ice cubes in Bartleby's Zazuni juice. They really do. <laughs> <laughs> you can find them out in the deep water. But I am not feeling them today. Shocking pink. If something happened to the ice stars... Then the living sea would get warm. Too warm for the sea creatures to live in. We'll go and check on the ice stars right away. Oh. That would be most appreciated. You're welcome. Whoa! We're gonna need a blubber sitter soon. Our poor sea friends. I must try and cool them down. Good idea, Your Majesty. And while you do that, Bartleby and I will find the ice stars. Mm -hmm. Okay! Cumulo, 
Let's fly out over the deep water of the living sea, please. Bye-bye. Water, water everywhere! Boy, the living sea should really be called the mega gigantic humongous sea. I guess your point is it's a really big sea? <laughs> huh? Hey, but I do see a couple of sailboats. <gasps> Those aren't sailboats. They must be ice stars. What do you think would happen if I lick one? <laughs> you probably get the biggest brain freeze ever. <laughs> <laughs> they should be making the water cold. Are these ice stars working okay? I'll just give them my cat's paw test. <laughs> Brr! Paw freeze again! Meow. Hey, but didn't the living sea say there was a whole family of ice stars? Hmm. It is a big sea. Let's keep looking. That's it. A gentle breeze will cool you off. Be careful now. There's enough shade for everyone. Oh, my. Now there's no shade for anyone. Oh. Are you all right, my little sea blob? <laughs> well, that was lucky. <laughs> We're going to have to find a new way to keep you shady and cool. <laughs> hmm, that gives me an idea. No ice stars this way. No ice stars that way. No ice stars every which way. Whoa, I'm getting dizzy. I might. Oh, oh. I've got you, B. Phew. Wait, I see one. Oh no, this is the ice star from earlier. I can see your paw print. Yeah, right. Wait a minute, there were two ice stars here before. Where'd the other one go? I don't know. We've looked everywhere and we still didn't find the other ice stars. And now we've even lost one. We need to figure this out and fast. Time for some wish help. Cumulo, to the wishing tree, please. Yeah! True, Bartleby, over here. Fern, engage blowing. <laughs> That's a fun way to keep cool. Fun and useful. I'm preparing the wishes for all types of weather. Windy weather, freezing weather, and sunny weather. Oh, so they'll be ready for all kinds of weather when they go out into the rainbow yeah. kingdom with me. Exactly. That one's getting used to the cold. Don't get brain freeze. Oh, well, it passes. And this wish is getting used to hot, sunny days. Uh-oh, look out! Whoa! Whoa! I gotcha! <laughs> you okay, little buddy? Are you here to cool off, too? Actually, Z, we have to cool off the whole living sea. The ice stars are missing. Oh, no. So the living sea is getting warmer. The sea blobs are leaving the sea to cool off on the beach. That is serious. Let's have a think about this. We've been all over the living sea looking for the ice stars. But we couldn't find them. So maybe they went under the sea for some reason. That's very possible. So we need a wish to help us search underwater. And then we need to make sure the living sea stays cool until we can get the ice stars back on the job. Good thinking, Drew. You've got a plan and you're ready to do it. It's time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me.
wishes. Let's see what the Wishopedia says about their powers. Your first wish is... Chillsy. It is a freeze wish that blasts super cold beams to flash freeze anything. That's perfect! It'll help us cool down the living sea until we can find the missing ice stars. Are you up for chilling the sea, Chillsy? That's a yes! But keep my tail out of this. Hasn't it shivered enough today? <laughs> Your next wish is... Bubba. It's an underwater wish that can help you breathe underwater too. We've already searched above the sea. To search under it, we'll need all the help we can get. Yeah, the only time this cat touches water is if I'm out of Zazuni juice to drink. Yeah, no offense. <laughs> <laughs> For your last wish, you have Wampin. It's a stomping wish. Nothing makes it happier than Wampin and stomping. I don't know how a stomping wish will help us find ice stars, but I'm glad to have you on board. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wishes with me. Good luck, True Immortal Bee. Thanks, Z. Hey, look! There's a new sandcastle on the beach, and this one's even bigger! It looks like the Rainbow King found a way to cool off the sea blubs. Yes, I'm delighted that they're finally comfortable now. But if the living sea doesn't cool down soon, it's going to get very crowded in there. We haven't found the ice stars yet, Your Majesty. But we have our three wishes to help us. Let's go, Cumulo. There it is! I'd know my paw print anywhere. Poor ice star. Cooling the living sea all by yourself. We've brought you some help. Ooh. All right, Chillsy. It's time to chill the living sea. Zip, zap, zoo, I trust you! Wake up, Chillsy! Wish come true! Hi, Chillsy. Let's see how far you can ice things over. Full power! <laughs> Great job, Chillsy. You can chill out now from all your chilling. Oh, so much better. Thank you for the chill, True. You're welcome, Living Sea. But you're so big, we can't freeze all of you. It helps quite a bit. But without my ice stars, I cannot stay cool. We'll find the rest of the Ice Star family. I promise! <sighs> okay, Cumulo, you keep looking for Ice Stars above the Living Sea while Bartleby and I look under it. Or, just thinking out loud here, Cumulo and I could stay up here! No soggy, drippy kitty that way! Oh, <laughs> uh, well, catch the cat again! <laughs> Freeze again? Are you kidding me? I am not having a good tail day. Aww, another sea blub. I bet you want to be in the colder water here. Hey! Whoa! Ah, careful! We just made that ice! Aww, and I guess you want someone to play with too. Why, oh why, do other creatures find me so irresistible? You are pretty cuddly, Bee. Why don't you keep little Blubby company while I go see if the missing ice stars are underwater? Bubba, time to do your stuff. Zip, zap, zoo, I kiss you! Wake up, Bubba! Wish come true! Hi, Bubba. Let's go under the sea. Of your family. A rope? 
What's a rope doing under the sea? <gasps> the ice star's being pulled away! Someone's taking it! La -dee -da -da now isn't this better than jumping around and cracking all the ice? <laughs> Do I look like a ball here? Put me down! I forgot to say gently. Oh, look, the last ice star is leaving. <laughs> the last ice star is leaving? That's bad. <laughs> and this is worse. Hold me! <laughs> sea Blob, where are you going? Oh. Wait, what am I worried about? Ninja kitties can jump from my slow to ice flow, right? One, two, ninja cat, go! Oh, two, must stay dry, must stay dry, must stay dry! Huh? You're dry. Oh, oh true. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> I'd hug you, but, well, you have a big Baba helmet on. It's awkward. We'll have a big hug later, B. Okay. Right now, we have an ice star to catch. Yummy <laughs> Did you find any more ice stars, Kimilo? Mm -hmm. Neither did I, but I know what's going on now. The missing ice stars didn't sink or float away. They're being taken away. Taken? Why would someone want to take an ice star? I'm not sure. That's what we're going to find out. Bubba, thanks for helping me underwater. <laughs> I know the ice star went this way, but I don't see it anymore. Hey, maybe my sea blood buddy saw it. <laughs> yes! Follow that pointing flipper. Look, there's a clue. A raft and some paddles, and they're still wet. This must be where they brought the ice star. <laughs> well, something's making it cold around here. Do you hear that? <laughs> the ice stars! They're all here! They are! Me, yo! <laughs> um, excuse me? It's okay. We didn't mean to startle you. I'm True, and this is Bartleby. They're wondering how we found their cove, and I'm wondering how I know that. Bartleby, you speak rockish? <laughs> well, a little. I mean, you know, cats are very good talkers. We followed you here. Are you the ones who moved the ice stars? They say they brought the ice stars here to cool down their home. They really like to play on the ice. But the ice stars belong in the living sea. Without them, it's too warm for the creatures who live in the water. <laughs> they say they're sorry. They just wanted to freeze the lagoon and go skating. They didn't know they were warming up the living sea. <laughs> But they sure cooled things down in here. All the ice stars in one spot might be too much, Chill. <laughs> we have to move the ice stars out of here. Come on, everyone. All right, everyone, get ready. And pull! It's frozen solid. <laughs> <laughs> we'll never get the ice stars out of here until things warm up again. And we only have one wish left, Womp It. How can a stomping wish help us warm up the canyon? Hmm. Wait, maybe we don't need warmth. When the living sea was frozen, do you remember how the sea blob bounced on the ice and cracked it? Yeah, and then I almost got wet. Oh, yeah. Cats, don't forget stuff like that. Wompit could do the same thing. Uh. It can stomp and stomp until all the ice breaks. Then the ice stars will be free and we can get them out of here. I am Woo! stomping yeah! with joy at this idea! Time for some wish help. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Wompit! Wish 
wish come true! Okay, Wompit. Ready to stomp it? Let's get stomping! With the Wompit Bam Slam, we're jumping up and down! With the Wompit Bam Slam, we're stomping all around! With the Wompit Bam Slam, can you hear that sound? It's the Wompit Bam Slam of our big feet on the ground! Wow. Jumping up, jumping down! Paws are up, paws are down! Huge hop, Wompit Bob! Keep on going, don't you stop! With the Wompit Bam Slam, all smiles on a frown! With the Wompit Bam Slam, we're breaking it down! With the Wompit Bam Slam, was there ever any doubt? That jumping up and down is what Womping's all about! <laughs> Our Wompit Stomping did it! All the icers are free! Time to get the Ice Star family back home to the living sea. How does the water feel now? Blop, blop. All nice and cool again. <laughs> <laughs> When winter comes and my surface is frozen, the rock creatures are welcome to come skating on me, True. Thank you, Living Sea. Did you hear that? La -da 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 -da. Oh, it is such a relief to feel cool again. I feel a wave coming on. Whoa! <laughs> Bartleby, I thought cats and water don't mix. <laughs> they don't. Cool. The sea blood got covered. Whoa! <laughs> 